but there was a point where there's a representation of the sense of self that was also kind of broken off and tossed to the back of the mind and joy and the parts around her had the intention or goal, which again represented a regulated system to try and retrieve that self energy essence and bring it back from the back of the mind. And there was a point when Riley, the character, was playing a hockey game and she got put in the timeout box and her mind was swirling. And I mean, there's an intense part of the movie where it represents this. And then there's a beautiful, what I saw as an unburdening of where those parts are kind of being resorted and those burdens or those bad memories are taken out. And I believe I'm getting this right with the movie. Again, my analytical part was all over the place, but the concept of those bad memories were being taken out, those burdens. And there's a part where the emotions embrace that sense of self, the imagery that Pixar identifies. And I really wondered if that was a representation of what self and self energy could be the best of our parts coming together and even embracing what was the sense of self in the movie as it was being restored. And not that what was being restored was the self, but those gifts coming in and uh, bringing that image back to its best because self can't be blemished. It doesn't need to be restored, but those parts hugging that sense of self, all of them at their best, that was self to me or a representation of self and self energy.